Hello and welcome to White Glove Reviews. In this video, we're taking a look at something kind of a little unusual. This is a sales winner, salesman sample case that has like sample pen and pencils. And it's, I don't know, I hope you all find it interesting. It's about, yeah, I call it almost five inches by, looks like about eight inches. And what it is, is it's got a bunch of the little sample pens that salesmen, well, pens and pencils actually, that salesmen would take to places to, you know, try and sell pencils and pens. So like over here, I'm hoping this is gonna survive all right. Like on this side, we've got some of the little weird, like kind of a, a pickaxe looking pencil. Uh, can y'all see that? Open 24 hours a day, pick us for service. Larry's Northside Technico, ah, Texaco. So, got like a little hammer, a little pickaxe kind of pins. Yeah, kind of cool. So these are the caps. Let's see what else we got. We got a shovel. <laughs> I guess the whole theme is tools. And they have little stuff on them. This one says, pardon our dust. We're remodeling to serve you better. Alwyn Alliance, uh, Music and Alliance Center. Huh. You know, I should maybe look these up on the internet and see. So that's a, a pen that looks like a match. Huh. That's kind of a that's kind of a, an interesting thing. And then we got these other pens. These look like just kind of general clicky pens. Hmm. Please inspect fill filler inside. Uh, okay, hold on. That's kind of interesting. Can y'all see that? I hope you can see the text. Please inspect filler inside this 54, I'm sorry, 540DL double life jumbo pen. It contains twice the amount of ink. So... If you get 150 and up, they're 39 cents each. Hmm. Let's take a look. Hmm. So there you go. That's a double life jumbo non-skip cartridge. Huh. It's kind of an interesting looking cartridge. Alright. It's kind of an interesting pen. So let's see. Um, this just looks like a kind of a normal clicky pen. Let's see if this has one of those double life things in it or not. Uh, it does not. It just has kind of a normal one. So far, I think that little double life pen is probably the most interesting one so far. Yeah, except for the weird light match, it, match pen. Let's see. Uh, Chrysler. Hmm. Magnavox. This one is different. This one feels much more substantial than all of them except for this one. This is Magnavox. Hmm. Kind of interesting in the souvenir department. The Hub, Chicken Steaks Pizza. Hmm. Kind of interesting. And this is something weird. Huh. What is that? No all else fails, bring it to our factory trained experts. 
<laughs> okay. So this is not a pin. I think this is a screwdriver. Alright. So it looks like to y'all, right? A screwdriver? Huh. This is super strange. I wonder. I don't know if I'm supposed to unscrew. I guess I can unscrew it. I wonder if there's some kind of trick in here. Uh, I don't think so. It looks like it's just a, a little screwdriver. Hmm. I'm wondering if I have to line it up a certain way. Hmm. I guess we'll see. So that's a strange one. Alright, we got those. And then we have some pencils. Uh, that's weird. I'm a member of Carson's Clean Plate Club, Carson Inn. Hmm. That is odd. So let's see what we got. We got a golf pencil. Whoa. <laughs> uh, this is a thing, I guess. So, it's a golf pencil with a giant eraser? That is strange. Alright, this is just a standard carpenter pencil, it looks like. We got a. Okay, I guess. Nowhere near as weird as this one, then. Alright, so just a normal pencil. Melinda sketch you where you want to go, Springfield Travel. Another pencil. Another pencil. And Mass's Cafeteria. Another pencil. Uh, okay, I gotta read this one to you. It says, Mark K. Brown, auctioneer, I cry for a living, and Thompson, Illinois. And that's a weird one. And then a little thin pen. A little, I'm sorry, a little thin pencil. Much thinner than the normal ones, for a quick comparison. Huh. That, is, that is a weird assortment of odd pencils and pens, isn't it? All right, so... I feel like, for unsettling creepiness, this one is the winner. Although, this is a close second for weirdness. And so, we've got the weird head pencil. We've got the... Uh, Alright, hold on. Erase all past mistakes. Get more results at less cost with Goodyear tires. Oh man, this is weird. So you got that. And then we have the sort of like secret screwdriver. It's kind of interesting. And then we have the the jumbo ink cartridge one. Huh. And then the the kind of Hammer, shovel, pickaxe, and match. Hmm. Kind of interesting. A little strange. But I guess interesting nonetheless. I don't know. What do y'all think? As someone who collects pens and occasionally pencils, some of these are weird. I don't know. What are y'all thoughts on them? Let me know down in the comments. And if you've run across any really super weird pens and pencils, let me know down there. It'd be kind of cool to see them. Anyway, if you've enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. And I hope you all have an excellent day.